Hi boys and girls, welcome back again for chapel in Miss Nancy's living room. Before we begin, I have a huge favor I need to ask you. This week is Teacher Appreciation Week. It's a week where we let our teachers know how much we love them. So I'm going to ask you to have mommy and daddy help you send a message to your teacher telling them how much you love them and how much you miss them and just how special they are. They can either email or text them or can email to Miss Nancy. I'll make sure the teachers get all their messages. But thank you. This will be a nice surprise for them to hear from you. So let us begin. Um, why don't we sing um, Jesus is a friend of mine. I love that song. Jesus is a friend of mine, friend of mine, friend of mine. Jesus is a friend of mine. He loves me all the time. So today our story is about the Good Shepherd. And I want you to think real hard. Miss Nancy has a favorite uh, window in the chapel. And it's a picture of Jesus as the Good Shepherd. He's holding a sheep, and he has sheep all around him. And this is what our story is about today, the Good Shepherd. Our dear Lord told his story once to people that he knew, a story about a flock of sheep and of their shepherd too. The shepherd knows his sheep, he said, he knows each one by name. They are his own. He watches them and loves them all the same. They know his voice. He calls to them. They follow where he leads. They trust that he will care for them, provide for all their needs. If thieves and robbers creep around or climb into the pen, the sheep refuse to go with them. They know that they're mean men. Sometimes a sheep will stray away from others in the bunch. The shepherd goes and looks for him and brings him back for lunch. If one gets caught, in a big bush or falls into a hole, the shepherd rescues him and then leads to a grassy knoll. Suppose a wolf attacks the flock and scatters them about. The shepherds would not run away. He'd chase that wolf right out. He leads the sheep back to the fold, each ram and every ewe. He'd give his life to save his sheep that's what he must do. What does this story mean to us, the children of today? Could we be like those sheep and lambs? When we go out to play, the Heavenly Father sent his Son to be our shepherd dear. We are the sheep he loves so much. He always wants us near. He knows each one of us by name. Now listen for his voice. And when he calls, just follow him. Be happy and rejoice. Jesus, my shepherd, hold me close and lead me day by day. Please let me always hear your voice and follow it, I pray. That's a wonderful picture with Jesus and the sheep and all the children following him. And now, boys and girls, let's make praying hands. Forgive me, God for things I do that are not kind and good. Forgive me, God, and help me try to do the things I should. Amen. Boys and girls, we're going to do the Children's Creed today. 
This is a, a prayer that we do with the um, four-year-old classrooms, and I know some of the children don't know it, but I want to say this today. I believe in God above. I believe in Jesus' love. I believe his spirit, too, comes to tell me what to do. I believe that I must be kind and gentle, Lord, like thee. And now the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. And let us sing one of our favorite songs, Allelu, Allelu. Remember what we do with our hands? Just follow me. Allelu, 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 Alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Allelu, 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 Alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord, Alleluia, praise ye the Lord, Alleluia, praise ye the Lord, Alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Let us go forth in the name of Jesus. Thanks be to God. Now don't forget, this is Teacher Appreciation Week, and send those messages to your special teachers. Thanks so much for doing that for me. I'll see you next week. Bye now.